Another tool that you might use for your long-coated dog is an electric razor. I've got two examples of razors here. Start off with a simple one. This is actually a small handheld battery operated. It takes one AA battery. So it's a small handheld battery operated electric razor. It comes with cleaning solution and a little brush tool to clean off the razor and it also comes with different sized attachments that you can place right on here and that helps you keep your distance from the skin. Okay, a couple different companies make them. They're relatively inexpensive and these tools are great to one, start getting your dog used to the sound of the razor. It's very convenient to use in small places um, when you're working on your dog, on their feet, um, little, getting into tight areas under armpits. So it's a great little tool to have in your grooming box, very handy. And you want to make sure that before you actually start using it on your dog that they are comfortable with the sound. You can see this guy doesn't care too much. He's sleeping on the table like he's supposed to be doing. Another type of razor, also indispensable at times for a large coated breed, is an electric razor. This is a larger type of razor. Okay, It is an electric one. When you go out to buy one, you can see here that this cord is a little bit long, but it's very, very handy. You never know where you're going to have to be plugging it in. So this is a very long corded electric razor. Uh, millions of companies, tons of companies make different ones. This is a fairly heavy, hefty one. Again, it comes with different attachment pieces. All right, so you know exactly how, what's the distance from the hair, from the skin that you're cutting. They also will come with attachment replacement blades. So this can be a very good thing to have with your dog. Um, if your dog gets very, very mad, if you have a long coat of breed and he gets very, very mad, you actually might need this tool to cut him down and start over from scratch, but let's hope not.